Today, I'm going to be taking you through the entire creative process from conceptualizing a video and then actually putting that into actions and creating the video and then edit the video as well. Hi, I'm Laura. I'm going to be making an Instagram reel slash YouTube short. Since you can use the same video on both platforms now, it has dual purpose. So you're making content for more than one area. If you're new here, please feel free to check out my channel and subscribe. If you like what you see, please give this video a thumbs up. It really helps push out my content with me being a new creator over here. That will really help my channel grow. I've had this idea for a couple of weeks now. It's the song that's been really trendy on Instagram and YouTube shorts. It's actually an older song but it's pretty girls walk like this so I wanted to do that and then do a funny take on it and maybe start off the video where they're walking normal and it's like a pretty girl walking I have a couple of different ideas and I'm gonna have to narrow them down at the end I know that I want this little clip to start off with proper walk and then I really want to add in some funny parts so it switches and then it's like funny ways of walking just to give it some humor I have a couple of different ideas and I'm gonna take you along with me today as we do some of those and then at the end we're gonna edit it and we'll see which ones get cut and which ones get to stay now for parts of this video since I can't actually play the copyrighted music I'm gonna have to just have other music play over that you will be able to see the actual reel and YouTube short when it's all put together and I will show you at the end of the video where you can find them and when just real fast because I want to dress the crown I'm wearing I just finished doing another video where I had to wear this and I just decided to keep it on while I transitioned into this video I really don't think I'm gonna keep it on the entire time that I'm filming this part of the video the first step I'm going to do actually is go over to my desk area and I'm going to try and time block the song so that I get all of the transition times right that way I know how long I need to film and that way I'm not filming too much extra footage because with all the extra footage it could lengthen the process that it takes for you to edit let's go do that first I think I might just use sticky notes to try and track the times of this song. I guess we're just gonna go with that color. For this reel, I want to try and get an idea of how many seconds it is between each of the parts of the song. So I have an idea of how long I want each clip to be. I'm hoping that by doing this, it'll make it a little bit easier during editing and not having to sort through so much footage because it is gonna be just an Instagram reel or YouTube short. It is just gonna be a couple seconds long. Good for me to know the amount of seconds worth of footage that I need to have for each shot. But for this part, I do have to cut out the music because you can't actually hear the song while I'm doing this. Cue montage now. Okay, I am glad I mapped out the times there. If you go from the beginning of the song, there's not as much seconds to work with that the, all the pretty girls walk like this. So I'm gonna go with the chorus part, which is like the middle of the song, because you have more seconds to work with. The first part is six seconds, the second part is four seconds, the third part is six seconds again, and then back to four seconds, and the last part is the shortest part, is the three seconds. A lot of different changes that I can make in between there. And if I wanted to keep it shorter, I could use the beginning part of the sound and then it would just be three changes with the six seconds, four seconds, and then the three seconds, and then that would be it. All right, I got that step done. And now I think the next step to do is to try to get different scenes shot. I don't know that I'll keep the crowd on or not. And then I need to know which versions I'm gonna do. I'm gonna probably make way more footage than I'm actually gonna use when I edit it all down and clip it together. And it'll actually probably take me more than one day because I'm not going to do everything in this hairstyle so I'm going to start it today and then finish it up tomorrow probably let's go get some filming done how I wanted to get this clip was have you hold my phone and then obviously filming it like for an Instagram or YouTube short and I want you to start off like my face I'm gonna be kind of looking around and then as I get up to turn I want you to turn and really get a good shot of my hair so when I'm walking this way 
I want the focus of it to actually be my hair because my hair looks really good today. It's really colorful back there and I want Charlotte to be appreciated with all the work that she did with my hair. Oh, it's rolling. Yeah, well this is like the behind the scenes of creating a reel. Hey part. guys! <laughs> this is my daughter, it's Ailee. She's gonna help me. She has her own YouTube short channel, so she makes yeah. a lot of shorts and she's gonna help me out with this one. And then make sure that like, it's here, so if you need to raise up the phone, so I'm not getting my double chin. Okay, <laughs> And that was kind of a funny walk too, which is kind of the whole purpose. Man, look at that hair, she did such a good job. Okay, I want a little bit more focus on the hair. Oh, but I guess she got it. Okay. All the pretty girls walk like this, 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 this. Pretty girls walk. That might work, and I don't know if we'll keep it, but that is definitely something we're going to do. That's the only part that we're going to film today. Tomorrow we are going to go to the park and then try to get different backgrounds because it's important to know what your background is. Zaylee doesn't always pay attention to backgrounds like the one you posted today horrible i had junk everywhere so my junk is just exposed but it's uh, fine <laughs> we're trying to get better about it's that it's still got like 300 views so that's fine <laughs> <laughs> that's they okay i mean junk. it's a normal house but yeah we're trying to get our junk cleaned up so tomorrow i have two different ideas that i want to do so i'm going to have her dress up um, in one of her really fancy dresses and high heels and she's going to put on her makeup <laughs> And then I want to do like a shot of her walking like a pretty girl because she's a pretty girl. And then I also want to do shots of like us doing like funny moves. Something like this, 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 you know? <laughs> this, 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 this. <laughs> so that's kind of the idea that we're going towards, but we'll get more shots tomorrow. That's it for today. We finally made it to the park. That's what it looks like. It's a little windy out today. Try to find a place to set up my camera. Brought my backpack with my camera stuff so that we can set up the camera and then film the reel. We should go all the way back there by the house because I don't want people watching us. But I like the butterfly. But there are multiple butterflies. So I only there. see and there's this butterfly and, and that one. There's a butterfly over there. Where? It's around the corner over here. That's too close to the houses. I like right here. It's been two days. I couldn't get up here yesterday. I was doing computer work and editing. We had to come today. The ground is a little wet because it did rain this morning, so that's a bummer. But that's okay. We're going to make it work. Let's find where I want it to be. <laughs> Look at that pretty girl walking. Oh, you know what? We could do the first part where you're sitting on the butterfly chair because I wanted you to be sitting and then get up oh, and walk that properly. Pretty girl to walk properly. Maybe we'll set it up like this direction. That way you get the scenery of the background. I mean, we do still have some campers because unfortunately there's like a storage place right here. Hopefully it's not too windy for you guys. The first thing I want to do is get my shots of Azalee for her part of the reel that I'm thinking that I want her to be in. I have her dressed up like a pretty girl. And here comes someone walking their dogs. Okay, so we got to be quick. But I do want to get my first shot of her sitting on the butterfly chair because I think it's really pretty. And then I'm going to have her walk like a pretty girl. And then we're going to get to the funny parts of walking. You're gonna be like facing this way, and then I'm gonna come into view, and when I come into view, you follow me. I think that might be enough clips. What do you think? <laughs> I'm just doing a dance performance in your dance dress. I think that's all the shots we need from here. It wasn't a lot. 
we are just talking about seconds for the reel, so we don't need too much footage. Now we just gotta go back and paste it all together. Back from the park, and now it is time to upload all of our footage and see how it all works. Let's go ahead and open up iMovie, create new movie, click the arrow up here, and then select. Now all of the videos that I have down here are the ones that we did in this video. The ones you saw outside with the brick, the one that you saw at the park. So just click the first one, hit shift, click the bottom one, that will highlight all of them, and then import selected. And this is all the clips that I have to work with. Now obviously this is too much footage because if you remember with my sticky note and my time blocking, I only need six seconds, then four seconds, six seconds, then four seconds, and then three seconds. I need to determine which one I wanna do first. Now I remember thinking that I wanted to start off with it being a pretty girl who's walking properly and correctly, and then I wanted to add in the funny part. And I also did a part where I was just standing there and then did this walk. So you can kinda of see a little bit of all the clips that we got. I mean, they are silly, but I don't know if they're gonna be silly enough. I don't know, we'll have to see. Let's start off with the one with Azalee sitting on the butterfly thing. Now, I am going to remove all audio that comes with this because I don't need the audio. We're gonna have that Pretty Girls Walk Like This song. So select, double click, detach audio, delete. I wish the wind was not blowing as much as it was. Okay, that's the part where the dress blew up. Okay. Now she's more looking like a serious pretty girl. All the pretty girls walk like, when I mean, she walked initially, I didn't like how she had crossed her arms over and she walked too far in the grass. So we ended up doing a reshoot, but only of her getting up. So we need to paste those two together and then also select it in yellow, double click, detach audio, get rid of that. All the pretty girls and then she is standing now so right there that she's standing I think I want to split that and get rid of the extra footage and now she is standing right here maybe this part I want to try to have one that's the most seamless walk like this 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 all right, and I do have her feet because she was wearing those cute little black boots and this is a walking video. All the pretty girls walk like this, 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 this. All right, I'm gonna play around with this for a minute to make sure that it lines up with the music. And of course you guys can't hear the music part, so sorry about that. I did a little time trying to match the music to it and it looks like this part is still too long all the pretty girls walk like this and then like see it's like right here when it's like this and i don't want it to be there i want it to be all the pretty girls okay let's see all the pretty girls walk like this this, 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 this. I think that might be where I need to stop. Right here is where we need to have the change. I wanna have an up close of the shoes right here. So let's see how this works together. Right here is where we need to switch to the next scene again. All right, so this is the first clip that we're gonna go with. So in the course part, we have longer to work with. That's why I decided to go with the course one. If you do the beginning part of all the pretty girls walk like this, you don't have as much time to work with. So now that we've come to the next longest part, which is the six seconds, I'm gonna try to do the one where we did out in the break and see how that works, where now it's just me looking off and then starting to walk, kind of mimicking what she's doing, almost like I'm trying to walk like a pretty girl, only mine's gonna be like a hilarious walk. All right, detach audio. And I only have six seconds to work with. So all of this, it's 8.7 seconds now and I need to have it reduced to six seconds. So obviously we can cut this part off and then part of the staring part off. 
since we already know it has to be only six seconds. Now I'm gonna play to see how this all looks together with the music. All right, now it's time to add in the two extra shots. I don't have as much footage to work with, so I might actually make some changes because so far there hasn't been a whole lot of funny part in it. So I may have to cut out some other stuff, but this is the one that I wanted right here. So the first one she was recording too long and then she tried to turn to get to me and I wanted me to just come into view. So this one, four and a half seconds. So like that's almost perfect because you only have four seconds for the next change. Right there, that might work together. All the pretty girls walk like this, 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 like this, 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 this. I don't know how I feel about it stopping because it's like I came to a stop instead of continuing. I might actually reduce it to three seconds and then also add in some of the other funny walks. All right, so that was three seconds. We get four or five more seconds and that's it. And then we have to see how it all pieces together. Okay, and then she had another really good walk, which I thought about incorporating. <laughs> now I'm down to like the last few seconds. And I might end it with Azalea walking properly because I've had like my little funny moment there. But I also might cut out this part, which is a shame because I really wanted Charlotte's hair to be featured. I think I have maybe just like one or two seconds to work with here. Let me just clip all the front part off and then obviously get rid of the grassy part. Okay, let's see how this plays through. Okay, you know what? I like the way that this turned out. I think this is what I'm going to go with for my final part. Looks like the music adds up pretty good. The only thing is I might try to figure out how to zoom this in because it is so far away. I just don't know. Like this clip is the one that I wish would be zoomed in more. So I just edited it in my photos, just created an edit and I zoomed it in. I think that definitely looks better because I didn't like how far away it is in this one. Now I'm gonna airdrop the new part and then upload that and change it. And then that'll be the end of this video. Yeah, I think it looks so much better. See how far away it was? And then now it's closer. So let's just drag it on top, detach audio, and then I'm going to replace it. Okay, I needed three seconds worth, so I think I cut out all this other part, so that way when I first come into view right here. So this, 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 okay, yeah way better and you can see the difference that the crop made so happy that i was able to edit it and crop it in the photos tool on iphone that was nice all right so i'm gonna delete the one that i don't need anymore so now i think i have my final look i'm gonna check it one more time with the music then i'm gonna download it i need to run it through canva which you don't have to do but running it through canva will eliminate the two black spots on the side i think i like the way it turned out i'm just going to go to projects I need to save this and I'm gonna put it as pretty girls short and then click this part right here. I'm going to share project to file and then save it and it will start exporting it to my desktop. Share successful. Now you can create YouTube shorts and Instagram reels in the app itself. You can do editing and stuff in there. I don't know how much editing you can really do when you're piecing together different clips. So I just am so used to editing with iMovie that this is just how I've been doing my editing. Now, if you didn't have a bunch of different clips, obviously your Instagram reel in short would be a whole lot easier to piece together. But with this one, I wanted to have different scenes and different switches and it needed to switch at the correct time. So it was really important to match it up with the song or the audio that I was going to be using. If you are interested in seeing how this YouTube short slash Instagram reel turned out, it is already posted on my Instagram page that is at Laura Wooten 22. So you can go ahead over there and check it out. If you wanna see it in YouTube shorts, it will be posted 
tomorrow evening and that is where you can watch it with the appropriate music along with it to see how it turned out. Final thing I do before I can upload this is I have to get this video on my phone. So I will text it to myself, save it in the text messages, and then upload it. That is the process that I have to go through because on Instagram Reels, you can't upload from the computer part. You have to do that. I think the same thing with YouTube Shorts. It has to come from your phone. I hope that you found this video helpful. Let me know what you think of this type of video where I take you all the way from the beginning of conceptualizing a video and having the idea for one and then the steps I took to put it all together and then the editing process as well. Did you enjoy the start to finish of this video? Let me know your thoughts down below. Please give me a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button if you have not already. And I will be back soon with another creative video. Bye everyone.